Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're going to be doing a BoxyCharm unboxing uh, for the month of June. So this month's uh, BoxyCharm is a theme of sunshine and it is the regular size box. So we'll be going over the products. I will be trying some of the products out today. I already have a full face of makeup on and then um, we'll be using some of the products on top of that. So the first product is from the brand a clean skin club and it's a vitamin C brightening booster um so it's a serum it's a full size product and it's from the brand clean skin club I've never heard of this brand and I don't really use vitamin C brightening boosters but um the price of this for a full size is $49.95 so it's a pretty big box, like it's the size of my hand. And it's a very nice bottle, it's class. Pretty bottle. I think I've seen this before, but I don't recall the name of the company. Um, but it is a uh, one fluid ounce, so it's a pretty decent size for a serum. Um, so this is the first item in the box. So then the next item, is from Studio Makeup. I've heard of this brand before, but I've never tried any of their products. And it's um, an endurance cream eyeshadow. So it's a shimmer eyeshadow. So this is what the bottle looks like. And it retails for $25. So this is a full size product. And it has a Dofa applicator. And here I'll show you a swatch of what it looks like. So it's just like glitter. You see that? It's just glitter. Um, so it's supposed to dry and not be tacky. So you can just you can um just use it all over your eyes, or you can um add a few layers. It says so that retails for twenty five dollars. The next product, which I'm actually pretty excited to try, is um. A lip gloss from Alamar Cosmetics and it's in the shade uh, Birthday Suit. It's a lip gloss. So this is a woman owned company. Um, she's also a YouTuber, um, makeup artist and her name's Gabby. So this is what the lip gloss looks like and I'll swatch it right here. So it's pretty sheer, but it's really beautiful. So I'm going to be trying that on today as well. Um, this retails for $15. So not bad for a full-size lip gloss. The next product is from Ace Butte or Butte. I think it's Ace Butte. And this is a called the Bronze in Paradise Palette. So it's a bronzer palette. So this is what the bronzer looks like. You get four shades and this retails for $30. So I feel like some of these colors are gonna be a little difficult for me to wear because I'm so pale. But, I mean, these would be pretty eyeshadow colors. So I'll swatch that. I'll swatch that here. So that's what the shades look like. Um, they're kind of chalky. So I don't know how that will transfer onto the face. But I also, I don't think I've heard of this brand. And then the last product, which I'm pretty excited about because I was going to buy one, not of this brand, because they also sell it, sell these at the Dollar Tree, <laughs> but not this brand, obviously. Um, this is from the brand Lavish. I think I've heard of this brand. I'm not too familiar with it. And it is a, a color switch. So for your eyeshadows. It has a little sponge thing inside. You rub your eyeshadow brush on it which I've already done. 
um, but you rub your eyeshadow brush on it and then you're able to go and apply like a different color on your eyes without switching brushes which is um, pretty nice uh, very useful if you don't have a lot of brushes or if you're like a makeup artist or something like that then you can you can um, just switch the colors without having to switch your brush um, so I am going to put on a little bit of eyeshadow on first because I do want to try on that um, eyeshadow topper so let me just wipe this off my hand so I don't get it all over my clothes okay so I will be using a new eyeshadow bra I mean sorry new um, eyeshadow palette well new to me I don't know if this is actually new um, this is from revolution makeup revolution The decadent palette I've seen this all over um, Instagram so I'm going to be using um, this palette and I will be using the color switch to oops, to use the same brush okay I use the color switch. Then I'm going to go in with the shade lavish. I'm going to put that all over the eyelid. Go back in to the color switch. And go into the shade Splendid. the same shade we're going to go underneath the eyes and then with the topper Sparkles to the inner corner. Don't rub too hard or else you will rub off. 
off the eyeshadow underneath. I'm just gonna pat it on. Okay. And I'm going to go in with the second shade, this one right here, and see how that looks. It's a little orange. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. I mean, I'd probably use it again, but it's very chalky, that's for sure. I feel like it would be better as like an eyeshadow, to be honest. It's not hard to blend, as you can see. It's not terrible, but I mean, it could be better. For the price, I mean, I wouldn't waste my money. It's $30. And I mean, I have other bronzer palettes that are way cheaper and are way better. Like even the e.l.f. bronzing palettes are, I feel like are creamier than this. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't waste my money. I feel like this month's box I mean, it was it was worth it just for the fact that you get a serum that costs forty nine ninety five. So just that alone, I feel like it was worth it. And then you get a lip gloss and an eyeshadow topper, which are really pretty to do like a simple eye look, like I did. But other than that, like if you're gonna go and buy these individually, don't buy the um, don't buy the palette. It's not worth the money, um, but everything else I feel like is worth it. So I'm just going to put on the rest of my face so I don't look so crazy. And I'll give you an overall. This one's from last month's boxy charm.
And then to finish the look, I'm going to use the Alamar Cosmetics um, lip gloss. It's a really pretty lip gloss. It is a little gritty because of the glitters, but it's nothing too bad. You can see how beautiful that is. It's a very nice like topper just over your lips or over like a nice nude um, lip lipstick. Just because it's so sheer and super glossy. Like this is a really glossy, glossy, glossy lip gloss. So overall, I feel like out of the out of the five products, what makes the box worth it just alone would be the serum because you, a vitamin C serums are expensive and you're getting it in a box that's like $35 or something like that. So I feel like that's worth it on its own just because it's $49.95. So you are getting quite a bit of a discount on it. And then the lip gloss, that's $15, so that's a nice thing to have. Um, and then the eyeshadow topper, the cream um, glitter eyeshadow, that's really nice. It's a really nice sheer gloss, um, super pretty. So that let alone is worth the price of the box. But I would say that $17 for a quick switch a quick color switch that's a little pricey I know that Morphe sells one and you can buy these sponges at like a hardware store you know like you can buy these sponges so I mean I wouldn't spend $17 on something you can just buy for a few bucks um, the Dollar Tree also sells something extremely similar to this it just is in the tin without like the sticker but that's a dollar so I wouldn't waste seventeen dollars on this but it's nice to have like I mean it's a nice add-on to the box I also wouldn't waste thirty dollars on this bronzing palette I mean like I feel like not many people can use this as a bronzer like it's difficult for my skin complexion to use this I can't imagine anyone like super like pale like more pale than me or having a darker skin complexion being able to use this like these colors are not really wearable so i i wouldn't spend my money on this you can get much nicer bronzers for way less um in other companies and yeah that's basically it for this month's boxy charm so try it out it's I mean it's a nice company to try out just to try out new products like monthly um but I feel like it's not as great as I thought it would be so I don't know if I'm going to even like renew my subscription for next month like I feel like I might cancel because I don't know I feel like I can just mm, get like better products just on my own you know but I don't know um give it a try if you'd like it's a nice subscription just to try new products that you've never heard of the brands or you've never thought of buying yourself um but um it doesn't hurt to try the first month is free then you pay for the next month so that's not bad um they get they do have um other deals on their website where you can buy like if you like a certain product you can buy it for less on there just that product alone so it's a cool company um but this month's box was nice except for this palette so I feel like it's still worth it though okay well I hope you guys like my video um like share and subscribe I will be posting um more makeup content as well um I know you guys liked the last video um so hopefully you like my makeup content as well uh thank you for watching uh share with your friends and family Bye.